One Macon man says he is aiming to end food insecurities within parts of the city. Arion Smith is a candidate for Macon Bibb Commissioner District 5, and he says he wants to do his part for what he calls home. Hopefully, within the next couple of years, these locks will be broken in this parking lot full of eager customers ready to shop at their new grocery store. Boarded up doors and shattered windows. That's the site at the old Kroger on Pianona Avenue. In 2018, the grocery store shut down, leaving many residents trying to figure out where to buy their groceries. Well, the closest place to me is either Bakersfield, which is at least 20 minutes, or either... Uh, presidential community organizer in Pleasant Hill native Arion Smith says he negotiated a three way agreement with the building owner, Active International, and national development firm, Axla Development Group, to bring in a grocer and storage place. So it'll be a multi facility. If approved by making bid planning and zoning in July, some of the building will be a new grocery store. The lack of food in our community is something that's uh, taken away from our community. And the remaining space will be a commercial storage place equipped with climate control storage units. Accela and Active have to close on the building before we can even move forward. Smith says they have a written up proposal but do not have any grocer tenants. He explains the building owner will advertise the space to potential grocer tenants up to three years or until a suitable occupant is found. We definitely need a story over this way. Smith is not sure how much the project will cost, but says residents of the surrounding neighborhoods are happy to support the rebirth of the building. In Macon, Jatrissa Wooten, 41, NBC News. Now, Smith says the owner of the old Kroger will agree to give nearly $55,000 to local community in effort to alleviate the food desert.